Men, why? Because the a sound is above the ta. And ta, if I had this, that's for the female. Ente, anti. Ente, anti. Here's another word. Vocabulary. Everybody should know this one. What does it mean? We. We. Who said Ann? Ann. Okay. We. No, we is not new. Not new. That's a long ways from wet. But good try. Wet. Means Ann. So if I wrote, if I, if I say Anna, Anna, wet, and T, what did I just say? What did you say? And an uncle? Mm -mm. Remember, uh, I means, and that is I, right? And T is you, right? So if I say, and well, and T, what did I just say? You and I. Good, that's good English. That's good English. And that's what you would say in good English. You and I. In Arabic, in your mind, you got to say an, 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 wa ante. But if you're going to translate it, you should use perfect English. Perfect Arabic should be translated in perfect English. Okay? You and I, you were right. But it's, uh, in Arabic, the way it's written here, an, wa ante. If I, okay, an means I, where ante, the ante is referring to who? You. Which you? What person? Female. So if I say ante, what ante? I knew who is this? the ante would be referring to Her. female. Okay, ante, what ante? Okay. There's another word that we're gonna learn, and then it'll be two more after that. Wow. There's two letters. The mean and the noon. <coughs> Muh, where air is math. Nah. Muh, and math is air. The noon has a rest uh, sign on it, so, so it's no math, nah, and no is man. Man. So man means who? Man means who? So if, if I say, that's okay. Man. Anybody? What's this word right here? Ente. Man, ente. What does man mean? What does ante mean? For who? Male. Male. So man, who you, right? What's correct English? Who are, you? who are you? That's your present tense form of the verb. It's understood. It's not written. But if it, uh, if, if it was, if, uh, if it was in the past tense, it would be can the verb can add. But this is a first tense uh, form the verb, man ante. Who are you? So if uh, if I say uh, man ante, who are you? Uh, Imam Nur Din would say, and And then Nur Dean. I am Nur Dean. Nur Dean. I am uh, Nur Dean. Okay. So, so Anna Nur Dean or Anna Elam. I Elam is I am Elam. Right? Yes. Okay. 
So if I say man and cheat, who's who's the you we're asking the question? Um, to who? who yeah, female. 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 So if I say sister Ta so man and uh, man and cheat, sister Tahita will say will say Anna Tahita, which is I am Tahita. All right, so man means who? And then we'll, we'll end up with two more words and then we'll close out. To write this letter, you start at the top, come down to the bottom, make a circle. That's the half sound. And the word looks like this. How many letters is there? Two. 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 That's the H, literal H sound, half. And this is the wet. Who? Wet. Who wet? Who wet? He. Who wet? He. Who wet? He. And then, those of you who didn't write any paper, I know you're going to have difficulty doing the homework next, next time. <laughs> All right, last, la last word. Ha with the castra, E sound is he. The, with the ya, yeah. it be he, right? Yeah. He, yeah, means she. Hua is uh, he. He, yeah, means she. All right, so what we just learned today is basically uh, do simple sentences. We learn some pronouns. I, you, he, she. You got to know that. I don't want to read the Quran. <laughs> and I will lose Muslim. I am the first among the Muslim. Anna. All righty. Uh, with that, we're all done. And then we'll uh, prepare for. Uh, uh, the next part of our first Sunday. <coughs> <coughs>